Hey y'all, welcome back to Amazing Faces by LaShondra. Here we are again using the BH Cosmetics Peridot palette for August. I am so excited I was able to come up with a second look from this palette, not using any other palette for my look. So you guys, um, if you're interested to see this tutorial, stay tuned. Okay, so let's jump into it. This is the second look with my Peridot I know in the last video I said period, but it's really period dot palette from BH Cosmetics. Um, I am going to go in with this color on my lid. Um, this is the press glitter, and I may use this. I'm going to use these four, these four colors. Okay, and I'm going to use this is just a Wet n Wild shader brush. This is the same color that I used last time on my outer V. I'm actually going to bring this into my crease. Now I'm buffing this out with that independent that's this color here. Now I'm going back into that green because I didn't want to wash this away, but this is just to mesh these colors together. I went back into that outgoing color. That's the yellow color that's in this palette. And I'm just going to highlight my brow bone with that. I got to say, this is one of the best pressed glitters that I've used in any palette. To be able to use a brush and there's not much glitter on my face. I see one speck there and just a few here. At the, but this right here, this is one of the best pressed glitters that I've used inside of, of a palette. All I'm doing is going into my outer V to blend this out with that same green color. I'm going to use Il Maquillage. This is my foundation. I'll be using this one today. This is the Il Maquillage in Flawless. Um, the num my number is shade number is 15. This is my Juvia's Place Foundation Stick in Congo. Okay. I'm gonna use this today to blend out my contour. Time to blend out my concealer. I'm going to just blend all this in because you can tell the difference so that way when I set my face, it sets properly. There's no additional product on this brush. Just blending all of this together, just patting it in. So this is how you get a flawless face. Blending is key in makeup. I'm going to use my Fenty 
Beauty Pro Filter in Hazelnut. I'm just gonna dab some of this off on my on the back of my hand. I'm going to use my contour palette so I can make my contour a little bit more darker. I'm going to use the same brush I used to blend it out and I'm going to contour with this darker shade. In this palette, it's the dark to deep. And this brush came from Amazon and I really like it. When, especially when it comes to me doing my contour. It's so precise because of this. And it's good for under eye setting as well. I think that's what it's used for. But I like to use it for my, um, to have better control over my contour. Wet and Wild. Bare Focus. Just to set the rest of my face. It's a setting powder. Press this into my skin. Okay, it's perfect. Line my waterline. And I'm going to use this period color to go underneath this is the elf big mood mascara so thin under my eyes this kimchi, it's called Taylor Blush. Gold Sands, same brand that I used in my last video. And this time we know that we need to use our finger. <laughs> and this is just how much I put in this top. Just gonna dab that. That's a lot on my finger. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna dab that off a little bit. Yeah, and these came four in a pack. La Masca. New Lust by Maybelline. And I'm going to top this with peaches. And this is my completed look. This unit I, I got off of Amazon, and you can find that on my Amazon store. I'll provide that link in the description box. Again, I want to thank you all for joining me. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll talk to you soon.